Mabin. Mabin is the second of the harvest festivals centered around the autumn equinox. This festival calls my hands to the land to gather and my heart to reflection and gratitude. Here the shadows grow long across the landscape. The hay has been brought in and the sweet smell of bramble berries fills the sunny days. With equal measure of light and dark, I am offered the mixed blessings of life and death. I rise with the sun and sleep just as the night is falling. I celebrate Mabin for a good week when the days and nights feel even. And in this equanimity, I ponder. I seek out balance. Honesty feels so present, as well as the embrace of friendship. I reflect on the wisdom of the harvest in the language of nature. My spirituality is rooted in nature, and that spirit speaks through the trees and on the breeze. She tells me that time began in a garden. She has taught me that in times of plenty, I share with others, but she has also taught me in those times to save in anticipation of what's to come. Yet not all of the harvest is for us. We share with earth and her inhabitants. Her wisdom teaches me that sometimes what looks lovely on the outside is not so lovely on the inside. Conversely, what doesn't conform to standards of beauty often holds the sweetest of contributions. And that struggle makes for the best fruit. She whispers, remember that even that which is broken within you still has something great to contribute. Often the very best things are just out of reach, yet working cleverly with forethought, they can be attained. Sometimes it takes a lot to create something small and special. I have learned if I look hard enough, I will find it, but maybe not without receiving a scratch or two. Nature offers us everything. May we all hold her sacred and with care. Mabin is a time of reflection and gratitude. What are you grateful for? <laughs>